I'm Minnie Heilbrunn at the StubHub Center for the Chargers-Eagles game, and this has overwhelmingly been an Eagles fan base here. It's been the loudest and biggest opposing fan base that we've seen at StubHub yet. A lot of chanting going on, a lot of yelling, and a lot of green in the stands. I went around at halftime to talk to Chargers and Eagles fans about what their experience has been like in this mostly Philadelphia atmosphere. I mean, I definitely can't enjoy myself. Even though I have great seats at the bottom, I'm up here because I can't sit anywhere near my seats because everyone around me is Eagles fans. They're all cheering for the Eagles right now, so why would I want to stand there? I'd rather be over here and kind of be with the less popular guys. It's definitely disappointing to not only have to pay for the, the tickets, expensive tickets, we had to pay for expensive parking and the gas to come up here just to not even enjoy myself. I mean, I'm up here when I should be on my seats that cost so much money. Why, why, why am I up here? And I should be down there enjoying the game. Listen, we overpowered this whole stadium today. When I came here and I saw that how many Eagles fans was here, I loved it. Being from Philadelphia and me coming to San Diego and seeing this and feeling like I'm at home, I love it. I think it's okay. It doesn't really give us a home field advantage, but I think it's good business. You know, all these Eagle fans are coming out paying the bills. Honestly, I actually feel bad for the Chargers fans. I'm actually here with a Chargers fan that's been a San Diego Chargers fan for life. I'm an Eagles fan for life, but to walk into the stadium and for us to have that particular advantage over them, it's, it's really unfortunate. We feel at home here, and you should not feel like that on your opponent's stadium. You shouldn't. I wish all my friends from Philly were here. I've already texted my friends. It feels like a home game. Eagles are everywhere. We're singing the song, Birdtown, baby, fly, Eagles, fly. It's the same as it was in San Diego last year. I mean, when you go to a Raider game or a Denver game or Kansas City game, it's 65% opposing team. So it hasn't changed here in L.A., you know, as far as I'm concerned, it's the same thing. Yeah, we took over. We took over Chargers. So basically it's like a home game for us over here. It feels like we're in Philly, baby. It feels like it's a home game that we're taking over. Taking over, baby. When it comes to the L.A. Chargers, they're not the L.A. Chargers. They're the San Diego Chargers. Dean, you need to move the team back to San Diego. That's where they belong. It's going to be like this every single game. No matter who comes to this game, it's always going to be the opposing team that comes to this game. It's this stadium. It's not going to be Chargers fans. Look, this is why. Hey, this is what the f***ing stadium should be. This. Not, not this. It's to be expected. I mean, you're relocating to somewhere where the Chargers are not even wanted. They're like the third or fourth wanted team in L.A. You got the Raiders, the Rams, anyone else, and then the Chargers last. E-A-G-E-L-S, Eagles! Yeah, we're drinking too, so. <laughs>